shining coal and iron gold and what can be found Soon or later creepers come my way I never find a diamond anyway So my tools keep on breaking away So I got uh, tons and tons of feedback, uh, which is awesome, and uh, the conclusion seems to be, number one, that the kind of U-shapes between the windows kind of broke the stripe, so I had suggestions to either make the stripe double thick or single thick. I went with single thick for now. I think it looks pretty cool, but... Um, I don't know. I think uh, a double wide stripe would look pretty good too. Um, also the floor was not popular, uh, mainly because a wooden floor is not very lab-like, and uh, I think that's true. So I'm going to see if I can come up with a better uh, floor design. And then the uh, glowstones up here on the ceiling uh, they didn't look right to people because they are kind of just sitting there and uh, most of the suggestions were either that they should be inset or that uh, they should be hanging and kind of like mounted, kind of like chandeliers or hanging Aww. lights. So at the moment I've only changed the stripe. Um, I'm going to make the other changes later because they're a little bit more involved. And I haven't quite decided how to change the lighting yet. Now, uh, another thing is I ran around and did more resource collection off camera. So I brought all the... I stopped back at the uh, dog fort and brought a lot of supplies over. Um, I don't remember if I talked much about this, but I did make a bunch of TNT out of that sand and uh, gunpowder I brought over. Um, not much different here brought this stuff over. I can't remember what I had before, but I've got a little bit more building supplies. Um, I've consolidated a lot of my ores, so I think I have just about everything here now. I also made a little bit more stone. Um, oh yeah, I have a ton of glowstone dust and glowstone now. Um, because uh, during my nether digging, I did hit a couple of areas that had easily accessible glowstone, and really, you know, I used to not be uh, a fan of how difficult it is to get glowstone, but if you just find a good, um, oh wow, a, a good uh, vein or two of glowstone in the nether, uh, you get a ton. So this was really just two or three veins of goldstone. Um, and I, I don't know if you heard that, but there's some wicked thunder going on. I don't even know if I'm going to be able to do a full session tonight. Uh, so if this ends up being a day late, that's why. Uh, we just had a ridiculous uh, dust storm followed by what's supposed to be a th severe thunderstorm, so... Oh, yeah, that didn't even cover everything here. Um, I brought some more of my growable items here. Uh, and uh, I got a couple of leaves. I'll explain that in a second. After you see this, um, I consolidated all of my dye-related things, and uh, I chased sheep around for a while. <laughs> and I did that off-camera because it's such a tedious task, uh, chasing sheep and trying to get a decent amount of dyed wool from them. Um, it takes a good amount of time. An hour at least for just a, a uh, what you would call a significant amount of wool. And that's how I ended up with leaves, is I, I sheared accidentally a couple of leaves off of a tree, uh, but I hung onto them in case I want to use them for decorative, purpose, uh, decorative purposes or something like that. So yeah, that's, uh, that brings you up to speed on all the junk that I have collected. Uh, yeah, nothing interesting. Nothing that needed to be recorded. So, I am going to basically dive right into 
a time lapse again because uh, the initial part of the lab that you saw there is not the finished product. That was just the beginning. So I'm going to get right to work right after I take a nap. As you can see, I was sort of hashing out a uh, game plan for this whole area here. Uh, but um, to reveal a little bit of what I'm planning, I want to put a tower in between, uh, or some kind of a platform. I want to put something up between the two buildings. So I'm going to get some more uh, glass and stone cooking. And then I'm going to start tearing up my floor. Alright. Now I've got a 
fair bit of supplies again. Um, now this is going to be a little bit like uh, starting completely over, but I'm thinking... Um, I'm not sure whether I want to finish this up here or tear up the floor first. I think I'll go ahead and tear up the floor. seem to agree with what I was saying that Tiki Torch party lighting belongs in backyards and not inside of laboratories with arched ceilings. It made it look too much like uh, a cathedral or something, like these were candles. So I hear that and uh, trying to come up with something a bit better. Alright. So I got all that taken care of. Um, now I think I know what I want to do with my ceiling lighting. At least for the moment. For now. So I'm going to tear these guys down. And... I'm going to mount the glowstone in the ceiling, like that. And instead of three, I'm just going to have the two. And that should look a bit better. It'll still light things up quite nicely, but it won't be sticking out in a weird fashion. It looks a little bit more integrated with the architecture. Just like that. It does indeed look better. And as you can see there, I'm keeping my little plus. And this room's going to have one of its own as well. So I should probably... I can throw that down right now. So that is one, two, three from the edge. So one, two, three... it is. And while I am in here, I'm going to go ahead and do the lighting in here as well. And that's the one, and number two. And we can actually see how that looks. It actually seems like it's going to be just a bit dim, so I'm definitely going to need some other kind of lighting than just the, uh, the ceiling light here. It does seem to do an okay job with the ceiling, but reaching the whole room, not so much. So I'm going to throw down a couple of torches here just to keep things from spawning okay now for this floor in here I've uh, been thinking I'm going to use this gray wool Whoa, that's dark. Actually, no, I can't. I can't see for crap. <laughs> uh, here we are. Yeah, I'll have to finish that ceiling first before I decide. Well, not necessarily. I, I'm going to definitely need some lighting in this hallway, so I'm going to throw a glowstone right up in here. There we go. 
Is it sufficient hallway lighting? Eh, it's not bad. Smaller room, easier to light. Okay. Now, yes, I was going to do um, some of this dark gray wool. And I kind of want to keep the cobblestone lined floor theme, so I'm going to go ahead and do this. Let's see how that is. I like that. It looks very nice. Very, very nice. Alright, so now I have a whole bunch of crap. Um, I'm going to run and drop that off and switch things over to daytime. spider. Alright. Spider might, uh, trick me, though. Ah. Oh. Almost, spider. But I know your tricks. I've seen your tricks. Okay, so I'm gonna ditch some of this stuff. Um, I'm gonna hang on to the glowstone. Okay, so if I want to do two of the same floors, I'm gonna have to have two of every darn thing. Uh, so... Sixty white for each floor. That's all I have for each floor. Six, eight. Seventeen. I need to figure out how to make a pattern out of these. I'm going to have a very noisy floor. Well, not too bad, I guess. Alright, so I've, got, I've only got six of the dark gray. So, this might be somewhat logical. And... light gray... <laughs> this might take a little while. <laughs> Unfortunately, I am actually running out. I'm not going to have enough to do both floors, which is a drag. I'm going to have to go punch a bunch of sheep. A lot of 
those sheep. Well, shear them anyway. Wow. Well, now, wait a minute. I do have a lot of this left. What if I... Dang. Pretty good. Undo, undo. <laughs> How does this look? What the? <laughs> uh, whoa. <laughs> it was an ambush. Fill this, more of this in to really get a, a good feel for wh how it looks. I think this actually kind of ruins it right there. Oh yeah, that's better. I think that's better. This looks a lot better. It, it matches the whole, the rest of the um, building a bit more. It looks a bit more like a lab, or as some of you were saying, a hospital. But I think the hospital is just the the red and white and gray theme getting to you. Definitely need more light in this hallway. The one. Glowstone is not going to cut it. Well, that still seems really dark. Anyway... Alright. There we go. Pretty much done. Oh, I left a dirt block up there. Oh, that's annoying. Except for, um... Pretty much done, except for I have to figure out I'm going to wrap this up up here, and, uh, get rid of that dirt block up there. I think they're uh, they're looking pretty cool. Looks like a couple of uh, hangers, like at an airport. And then I'm gonna kind of connect the two of them and put some kind of a uh, platform structure up in the middle. Don't have enough stone. Don't have enough cobblestone either. <laughs> so many resources are required to build nice looking things. Alright, I'm gonna do a little bit um, <clears throat> more resource gathering and then I will be back. Oh, and I'm gonna put some torches down to keep the mobs away. Talking about Minecraft 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 Talking about mom.